Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Autofill is a feature that lets Excel automatically fill in a repeating pattern you establish. For example, you could fill in the months of the year, days of the week, or any repeating numerical pattern. To do this, first select the cell or cells that establish the pattern. Then look for the Fill handle in the lower right corner of the selected cell or cells. It is a small square in the lower right corner of any active cell or cell range. Move the cell selection cursor, which looks like the chunky white cross, towards this box and try to fit the upper left corner of the cross up into the lower right corner of the cell or cell range where the fill handle appears. When the cursor is in the correct place, it turns into a thin black cross. This is the autofill cursor. At that point, just click and drag the handle out, either horizontally or vertically, to fill in the selected range. As long as the initially selected cell or cells contains the beginning of a pattern that Excel recognizes, it then fills in the range with the rest of that pattern. The names of the rest of the pattern also appear in a screen tip as you click and drag over the cells. Now if Excel doesn't recognize the entry in the initial cell or cell range as establishing a pattern, it instead copies the first cell's contents into the rest of the cells you select. Actually, this is very handy if you just want to copy the same cell entry over a range of cells. Excel also recognizes patterns you establish. For example, if you type 2 into a cell and 4 into the next cell and then select both as a cell range, you could then drag out the rest of the pattern. In this case, it's a numerical pattern that increases by 2 for each new cell value. After you click and drag the autofill handle, you may also see the autofill options tag appear next to your selection. If Excel did not establish a pattern, or established the incorrect pattern, you can click this button and then choose the fill series option or one of the other available options to force Excel to try and recognize the pattern you selected. This may happen if you initially selected an ambiguous cell value, like the number 1 as a starting cell value for example. In this case, Excel defaults to simply copying the value. You can click the Autofill Options Smart tag and then choose the Fill Series option to change the copied value to values that increment by 1 instead. This can also happen when using date values. If Excel doesn't choose the desired method of incrementation for the date values, you can often choose the desired method from the Autofill Options Smart tag. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.